owners of Legoland New York Resort. On this show, we share the latest happenings of the ultimate Lego theme park destination, coming to Goshen, New York. Welcome to our fifth episode. If you haven't watched the previous ones, you can find the links in the description. In today's episode, we are going to help you plan out your visit to one of our favorite themed lands. Lego Castle! There's a lot of things to do in Lego Castle. You're probably wondering where to even start. Don't worry, we'll help with that. When you enter Lego Castle, the first thing you should do is either ride on the dragon or the dragon's apprentice. Or you could just ride both. Yes, definitely. The dragon is perfect for older kids who love to fly fast. And Dragon's Apprentice is for little builders who just got their wings. Both coasters take you on different quests. On the Dragon, you'll save the kingdom from the evil wizard and his dragon. On Dragon's Apprentice, you'll help train baby dragons. Both coasters are pretty awesome. You should definitely add them to your list. After you fly with the dragons, you should definitely go to the Royal Market. That's where you can get Lego sets and royal outfits. Everyone is royalty at Lego Castle, so be sure to pick up some new garments and treasures. You can also put yourself to the test and try to pull a sword out of its brick stone. You'll become a true knight. The next thing you should do is head next door to the Builder's Guild. The Builder's Guild is an awesome area for the King's Castle. It's dedicated for building with all sorts of Lego bricks. You can build your own castle or dragon's lair. I can't wait to see what everyone builds. Me either. After you build for a little bit, you should go on another quest. There are more rides in Lego Castle, like Tower Climb Tournament and Merlin's Flying Machines. Both rides are tons of fun. On Tower Climb, you work together with other knights to determine who is the champion of climbing. On Merlin's Flying Machines, you will help the wizard test out his new contraption. You'll see how high you can fly. Looks like you'll take the sky in all of the rides of the Lego Castle. Definitely, Julio. Now the last thing you need to make sure you do when you visit Lego Castle. Be sure to grab a bite to eat at the Royal Feast. Royal Feast is a sit-down restaurant where you can have burgers, chicken sandwiches, and more. Or if you're looking for something sweet, you can head on over to Wizard Frozen Wonders. They have all sorts of ice cream. And the best part, not only are they tasty, but the colors are magical. I can't wait to try it. Well, there you have it, builders. Hopefully this video was helpful when you plan your visit to Lego Castle. There is so much to do. But what are you most excited for? Let us know. And don't forget to subscribe for the next time we have a hot chocolate chat. And give our video a like. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.